We got Mochot over here. Uh, Utsuro, why does Utsuro keep showing up? I got better. <gasps> You're awake. Where are we? I don't even remember this room. Yeah, I, I guess there's an infirmary. Somewhere. Maybe it's on the ship, maybe? That would explain that, maybe. Or maybe yeah. we have access to other islands. Oh, do you think that's how the ship works? It's how we to can, go to other can, islands? There's no big bridges. Fast travel. The Mono Beast? The Mono Beast, the mono beast it, 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 it disappeared? Uh, yeah, it's go, so go funny, dude. <laughs> She's not laughing. What? I... Where am I? There's just like... <laughs> We're in the hospital, dummy. You've been asleep for 20 years. Oh god. <laughs> Not again. Not again. Hajime's been, Hajime's been trying to feed you Mountain Dew while you <laughs> sleep. He's putting energy drinks I've just been... in the IV. <laughs> <laughs> been keeping me alive for centuries. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. Just work on me. We'll work on all. <laughs> work on everyone. Yeah. Gotta stay healthy. <laughs> it's important to focus on your <laughs> health. My bloody energy drinks. Oh no, he, he donates blood and they can't take it. <laughs> I was like, what do you mean? <laughs> he gets so pissed about it too. <laughs> I'm worried sick, you know. I was starting to look like it was starting to look like you were never gonna wake up. Your Yoriko. Oh, so you do remember my name. Thanks, Sora. Uh, right, I was stabbed by somebody. <laughs> you were stabbed by your classmate, Siobai. Siobai? Guess so. Chobai. Chobai. Siobai. Either one's fine. Days passed since then, you know? It's noon right now. As you fade, Monaco freaked out. It's not something like violence like this isn't allowed in a school environment. It was not to do anything until further instructions were given didn't expect him to go guns blazing to say fuck it I'm, I'm done well because because uh he didn't even explain the class trial shit he just said you have to kill someone and then siobai siobai was like okay yeah <laughs> bandage who treated me a firefighter uh. oh so, oh okay um believe it or not <laughs> and it was courtesy from none other than siobai himself after he heard the class trial he was like fuck shit ass <laughs> He was like, I, I really wanted to stab Yuki. I didn't mean to stab her. I yeah, really right. wanted to stab Yuki. Can we, uh, can we just say this is my bad? Uh -huh. Put a mulligan on this one. You're telling me the person who stabbed me also treated me? I didn't get it either, but he said he, it was a mistake and that he would treat you as an apology. No one else here had medical knowledge, so we well, had no choice but to let him. Talk about mending fire in one hand and water in the other. He's the he's Avatar? The avatar. <laughs> That's what he is? He's the ultimate, ultimate avatar. avatar. Dude, now we have two people that can shoot fire. Does it hurt or anything? It's, it's possible his apology was just going to hurt you even more. Damn, that's fucked up. <laughs> that would be pretty fucked up, dude. <laughs> it stings a bit, but I'm fine. I'll have to go thank him later for stabbing me. No, you don't have yeah. to thank him. It was an apology. <laughs> What are you gonna thank him for? He stabbed you, you know. It even out. It even out in the end. Yeah. Ah, right. So, Sora, since you can move, can you come to the dinner? I don't think evens out. If someone stabbed me, even if unless it was by accident, I don't think I would forgive you. I don't think. I mean, <laughs> even if, if it they... was an accident, it'd be hard to forgive someone for stabbing you on accident. Like, oh, I was wrong with my knife. Oops. Well, I mean, like, what if they were moving something and a knife was on well, the Well, he guess. didn't accidentally stab you. That's you jumped saying. in front of the knife. <laughs> True. Yeah, see? <laughs> so technically, it is Sora's fault. It's, it's true. See, yes, like, Shofai yes, like, yes, like, did nothing wrong. He is best boy, actually. He was just gonna stab Yuki, who Utsuro. Yeah, he's the so, mastermind. Like, Hello. He's He's a little. I mean, you gotta give him a little leeway. And this is where the Shiobai defending starts. Oh, you were, well, I defended Surugi a lot the whole time, basically. Yep. Well, Surugi had was. some decent points, to be fair. I mean, yeah, he was like, like he killed all of his friends to kill people he didn't like. 
When he was like, hey, Akana, you should go kill yourself. That was pretty justified, honestly. Yeah, I mean, that was pretty... Whoa! <laughs> I love in Chapter 4 when it went, you should kill yourself now! And the lightning strikes. <laughs> Nobody had anything to do, so we investigated the island. Everyone's gathered there to share the results. Which one is the diner? The diner? Now that I think about it, what is this place? Okay, yeah. We're on something called the Mono Cruise. It's a cruise ship with dorms and all sorts of. Wait, this is where the there. dorms are. That's awesome. It was the big boat dock at the beach. You must have seen when you first went up. I wasn't looking. I told you. <laughs> yeah, that boat. I remember. The one that was lost. How do you walk the boat? We still don't know how the specifics show. We don't. We still don't know the specifics. So that's why we're inducted. That's why we're meeting up now. In sort, you should really come to the diner and participate. If not, just rest some more. Okay, got it. Can someone get this uh, Mountain Dew out of me? <laughs> no, keep it in there. It's good for the show. He's just hiding behind like the, the platform on the right. He's just hiding back yeah. there. He's looking over like, yeah. did she like it? And, and then she, Yuruko's like, shut up. <laughs> She's gonna find you. <laughs> what she's in on? I know that's supposed to be an X-ray, but every time I look at it, I think that's an alien. <laughs> every time I look at it, I just see <laughs> Monster Energy Drink. <laughs> that's a Monster Bobby. Energy Drink logo up there. It's the new brand. No. <laughs> I meant the IVs. I just imagine. That's my X-ray. I'm turning me. into a monster. Energy <laughs> Drink. Okay. Okay. I'm taking this joke way too far, and that's I don't care. Monster Energy Drink. Not turning into one. I guess you are when you eat. Dude, Hajime is constantly at a battle in his own soul between Monster Energy Drink and Red Bull. <laughs> yeah, he is. Who will there win? Are two, there are two wolves inside of you. One of them is Monster, one of them is Red Bull. <laughs> My god. And Yoriko? Thank you. Why are you thanking me? Weren't you taking care of me? Watching over me? Just wanted to thank you for that. No, no, Hajime mm -hmm. over there isn't doing that. that. He just He's hid not. when I showed up. <laughs> it's like... Oh my god, is she a lesbian? Was I right? See? Was I right? Look at it! I told you! Cookie, you can't tell me we're wrong. It's perfect I wanted to watch over you. You're taking turns watching over you, and I just happened to be my turn when you woke up. <laughs> No, I mean, we, we could absolutely be wrong, but if the game does not go out of its way to prove us wrong, then it, there's nothing this game could do to, you know, convince me otherwise. She likes me. <laughs> but I'd be lying if I said I wasn't worried about you, Yoriko. Isn't the Sundare girl kind of cliche at this point? Damn. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm gonna go to the diner now, so... If you want to come, it's not like it matters to me. I love I'm how gonna... blunt Shoa is. Sora's just like, hey, you're cringe to Emma. <laughs> He's like, hey, you're Sundere, and that's cringe to Yoruko. Dude, she's just like Yuki for real. Anyways, looks like I was out for a while. Hello. Ah. Oh, what's this? When did you wake up, Sylvia? Ah, uh, nothing. Man. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Good morning, man. Relax. I'm just here to say sorry. I don't like it. Not like I can do anything, anyways. That monocle thing has its eyes on me now. Came to say sorry? Now that I think about it, Yoriko told me you treated my wound. <laughs> what are you up to? I'm not up to anything. I treat you because I was sorry. Thanks, man. We love you. Oh my god. <laughs> Did this guy even feel sorry look on your face? Uh, how could you tell? Because uh, I can look at your face. I could be trash, but even trash has their own beliefs. If, if something goes beyond my intentions, I take responsibility for that. That's why I don't understand. It's not like I have to explain my own beliefs to you anyways. Is your belief, I'll see Yuki, I stabbed him? Anyways, I came here to make sure your treatment went well. 
Some crazy guy went in there with a bunch of <laughs> Red Bull Mountain and a Monster Energy drink. I thought... I'm not for that Hajime cool. guy. He's, yeah. terrible. He's a lunatic, I think. <laughs> Looks like you're doing a lot better even now. You think it's that easy? Just forgive and forget? Even after you stabbed me? <laughs> you got some guts, huh? It's a bargain. Do I have to do a little more favors to you? I've already lost a lot of my end. Come on. What's your poison? Not Monster Energy Drink or Red Bull. Keep him away from me. <laughs> I know your name is Yovai, but I don't know your full name. I also don't know your talent. You didn't tell me when we first met. If you're really sorry, then you'll tell me both. And don't make me pay you a million dollars. You gotta learn how to bargain. You know how unequal that exchange is? That's what I want to say, but I don't really care if it's just that. You'd find out if I didn't tell you anyways. No way you, you've heard of me, but I'm Siobi Hashimoto. Siobi Hashimoto. Siobi okay. Hashimoto. Look at the black market as the open broker. Oh, that's pretty cool. I, I kind of figured you character. were some illegal thing. I figured you were some illegal thing. He's like, what's your poison? Dude, all oh, the cocaine on the oh, island, half the cast has been smoking is from you? <laughs> this all makes sense now. <laughs> Oh, You've been the one lacing all the energy drinks with coke! <laughs> he actually knew hard to me before this event. He was his deal. <laughs> so true. This is a new drug. We call this the greatest, most desperate event in human history. Stop, no. One huff. <laughs> It'll fuck your shit up forever. <clears throat> Broker. Pretty amazing, you know that? Not everyone can just commonly talk with the person who stabbed them. Anyways, we're even now, right? Can we stop talking to each other now? Coming to the diner, everyone's sharing their investigation results. I'd be better off investing in my own. Thank you very much. Okay. Bye. You're Love you. There. I can't tell if he's friendly or psychotic. He can be both. He can be two things. Another say, How about both? Still, I'm glad I finally got a proper introduction. Should head for the diner, like Yoruko said. Hello. <laughs> Everyone's in their classic spots. Hey! Kimono friend? What? I mean, that's a Kimono friend speech, you know? Do you like that anime by any chance? Oh, she likes anime. No, I like the manga. I really enjoyed it. <laughs> Rohar, are you making Kanade uncomfortable? You're some sort of weave. Oh no, she <laughs> hates weaves! No! <laughs> Damn. Yeah. It's just an anime, that's all. Uh, actually, I do like some anime a little bit. You watch ones. I really oh, hey! Corpse Party! That's the one I wanted Dan to play! Don't um, spoil Corpse Party, Kanade, please! Isn't that boring? Oi, oi! You, Dan. Can you guys just quiet down? It's Dan now. He used his trade. He took him. Uh, Dan swapped over to Hajime and gave Emma, the actress, over to Cookie. Which I'm okay with, because I like Emma. <laughs> Why is there so much noise when we just try to talk about our investigation? Just trying to talk about oh, Red Bull! Yeah. <laughs> guys, like, gotta I need a hearty breakfast! Red Bull. Did you guys see the 7 Eleven? They had so much energy in there. Anyway, uh. Anyways, Suka, after that, I... I'm, I'm, I'm realizing he's that doing the back. Nagito Sprite, where he holds his arms up just oh, yeah. like that. Is he doing anyway, it with Suka, after that, I... He, he does exactly this Sprite, Nagito. <laughs> he's trying to impress Setsuka. He's like, everyone loves Nagito, right? <laughs> everyone simps for the bad boys. I could normally handle just about anyone, but Yuri really tires me out. I understand where you're coming from. I don't think there's an even need for understanding. This is just like a natural law that Yuri is not comfortable to be around. <laughs> a quiet! Law. Quiet! If we don't be quiet, we can't move on with our conversation. Wait, isn't it Coco sleeping? Where the fuck is he? Oh, that's definitely another scoop. A person who uses the iPad while they sweep. Ha ha! Uh, um, Kokoro? We're starting now, so I don't know if sleeping is... Um, well, if she's tired... I'm sure information so difficult for this group. It's okay, Yuko. I'm half giving up, too. It's okay. Yuki, you've fully given up. 
By saying you have given up, you've fully given up. Huh? Sure. And I'll just like do a little pose like, yeah, it's me! And then I'll just like trip on my face and then open the wound again. Everyone's all... Yeah, just like a <laughs> macho energy drink and uh, Wedbo just comes spawning out. Uh, I don't have blood anymore, dude. Guys, Hajime <laughs> replaced all my lifeblood with this terrible shit. I only have a day left to live. He's like, wait, is that bad? <laughs> He came after all Sora. I mean, what else was I supposed to do? Hang out with Siobai all day? Yes. <laughs> yes. Are you gonna- are you doing okay now? Uh, 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 are you okay? Ow, I bit my tongue! Fuck! Oh, sure. Mike Glide. Thank goodness you're okay. Is there a single male character in this game that's normal? <laughs> I'm realizing uh, that Yuki? all of them are weirdos. Yuki's I mean, pretty normal. Pretty, he doesn't count. He doesn't he's out. Well, he's just shy. Shy around women. has a massive issue. This guy's yeah. a fucking wackadoodle. I think the normal, the most normal person we've met that's a male is like Sioba. Yeah, which is <laughs> weird. <laughs> that's not good. Okay, I'm not gonna say Sioba who stabbed Outside of Yuki, who, shit. like, we already know he's clearly not normal based off what's actually going on under the hood. Well, he hasn't been too weird. The weirdest thing he's done was stab someone. Yeah, Sioba just casually stabbed, but he said he was sorry. It's alright. He did apologize. I mean, he wanted, he just wanted to get out, and they said he had to kill someone to get out. But, so. like, I'm, I'm thinking oh, about it now, and I'm thinking, like, most of the male characters in this cast, they're just, they're off their rocker. Hey, don't worry, Soda. I wrote a whole article about you getting stabbed by Soba. Thank you. <laughs> Yay. Uh, Nikki just doesn't give a shit. This is embarrassing. This is my first time being so excessively welcomed like this. How do you know? You forgot. <laughs> sure, uh... Thank you so much. I'm very sorry you got hurt trying to protect me. Kinda no, no, no. To he said very, very sorry. That oh, second very, very doubles the apology. <laughs> I'm very, 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 very sorry you got hurt trying to protect me. <laughs> oh, dude, that asks quite a bit more. <laughs> if you even choose to injured, I don't know what I'd do. I'd fucking so, kill like, does your boy suck at stabbing, or am I just resilient? I mean, I, I think know. he was about to raise it higher, so I don't know. I don't fucking... Right, we don't have, we don't know how well that steel by guy treated you, so be extra careful. Yeah, you know, it's very important to keep my health in check. Fine, it really. In the end, well, it's as though my body moved on its own. Anyway, Yoriko said you were all gathering together to share information on your investigation. So, why am I looking at a playground? The atmosphere was so tense before I was stabbed. Was it all a dream? Didn't two people, like, die yesterday? She's, like, thinking that she's like, what the fuck? You didn't know who they were. <laughs> Dude, if I didn't know who someone was and I saw them get born to ass. <laughs> It was a magic trick! He's the ultimate wizard! Those people were props! They were dummies! <laughs> they were dolls! <laughs> the bullet was part of the act. Yeah. About that, we were all terrified, but none of us knew what to do. So you just ignored it? <clears throat> ah, yeah, yeah, man, Shinji! That was until Shinji changed the mood. He told us, let's just do what we can. That was a classic Danganronpa hope. Now he's gonna be, no, gonna be all embarrassed. And we were all inspired to cheer up. <laughs> There's nothing gained from staying so tense. I do find you a little too upbeat right now. I was very thankful to Shinji. It's fuck you, you're, you, yeah, I don't care. I was my very God. thankful to Shinji. Usually it's my job to keep people positive, but even I was in shock. That's right, we should really thank him. It's thanks to him we got out of that awful atmosphere. All these women are complimenting him. He's not gonna know what to do. <laughs> no, 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 I didn't do anything. It's my first time being praised by girls like this. I would have loved it if it just passed, if it just right paid to him and he was like passed out on the ground. <laughs> Man, you're really weird, but I'm jealous. Damn. See. <laughs> Turning a despairing <laughs> situation to a brighter one by working together. Oh no. You could almost call that. <laughs> <laughs> hope! Really? <laughs> you could almost call that. Hope! I can see her saying that with like the most like sitcom y voice ever. Goofy. He's a little goofy. Mm, but you're a boy. I don't want you to stare into my eyes. <laughs> Stop looking at me, idiot. Look away. I can't help it. This is my sprite at the moment. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> That's what I thought, bitch. <laughs> Dude, I'm in a staring contest and I'm fucking losing. <laughs> 
It's fucking suck. Get owned. Fuck you, Yuri. <laughs> Little asshole. <laughs> All the women hate you. <laughs> no, no, they don't. <laughs> mm, oh, another sleepy character. Here we go. Chiaki moment. Should fight Chiaki moment. Oh, Sora's awake. And now Coco is awake. <laughs> Good. I'm glad Sora's here too. Everyone, I want to hear about mm -hmm. each of your individual investigations. I think the girl who was sleeping is the one telling us that. Why does it hurt me? Uh, because she doesn't drink all the stuff you try to she steal off her. drink the energy drink, and that's why she was asleep. <laughs> Everyone on this island has been taking my drinks, except her. I can't stand her. <laughs> I'm gonna kill her. Coco, what are you doing? Oh, you oh. can't tell me that she's not. <laughs> That's kind of cute. You can't tell me, Cookie. You can't. <laughs> it's on I the nose the now. Fifth, you plead the, the fifth. You plead the fifth. Okay, I ain't saying okay. Shit. I ain't saying shit, man. <laughs> you didn't say we were wrong. You just said like, like you one, didn't oh, this character talk for five seconds, and then you immediately say they're gay. Well, we're right. So how about that? And the only reason I said it was because she said she didn't do it because of men, and she blushed when she talked to Sora. And, and now she's she blushing all the time around about women. what she said before about being like, oh, we were just taking turns. I'm sure they did, but, you know, she was probably there longer. She was embarrassed because she hit the nail on the head. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Hold on, I'm going to start talking before this conversation goes south. The island me right now. is called Utsuroshima. That basically means the island of nowhere. As the name implies, the island seems deserted. As to the island's size, you can circle the whole thing in about an hour or so. It's not that big. That's just weird about all this. Not... I've never even heard of such an island. Well, to be fair, I've not heard of half the islands that exist, so... You know... So true, actually. There's a lot of unmarked islands in this world that are owned by some random rich person. Like... You know, I don't Nicholas know. Cage owns an island? I didn't know that, but now I do. Or You're on Nicholas Cage's it. island? So true. But it's gotta be near Japan, right? No. You can't kidnap no, some across Russia. the earth in just one morning, right? <laughs> well, it wasn't one morning. But it's just, the island's climate is tropical. You don't see that kind of climate in Japan. It's probably more south than Okinawa. <laughs> what did you just say? So what? You're making fun of me for being stupid now, right? <laughs> I would never mean it like that. But Kanani, funny thing is, you can't you can't conclude that this that the climate sorry about that is tropical. Huh? Why not? Damn, it's on my characters. I wish I had a guy like you know that. What the fuck, bitch? <laughs> because he has a penis, he can't stand it. He just writes it down. Hey, this just in: man sexes to other men. <laughs> How did you come to that conclusion, Yuri? Oh, uh, the climate is tropical. The climate is tropical, but the plants and ecosystem are similar to Japan. Hmm. What is this discrimination? <laughs> it is. I mean, them. <laughs> what the fuck? Man? He's a I, I know, like the the word is misandry for sexism. Yeah, he's men, a missing but... person. It's not like this. It, is what it is misandry this? if it's a man doing it to other men? I think so. <laughs> I don't think there's a different term for it. I wouldn't I'll know. You know I'll masculinity. So that's I'll have you know, Yoi, the second I escape this island, I'm gonna write a very strong article about you. <laughs> tropical ecosystem. In Japan? Does that exist? To be precise, the tropical and East Asian climates have mixed. Though on the outside, it seems like a southern island. Knowing that, there's a high probability that this is an artificial island made by humans. Another purpose, one. however, is unknown. Are you your fish iron? What the fuck are we? The fuck are we? Well, it's bigger than the other island. That was big enough to hold the building and nothing else. For all we know, everything including the blue sky could be a set. And in actuality, we're somewhere in Japan. It's just taking it too far. So what? We checked all over the island, but we didn't find anything legit? <laughs> except, Ma except Mountain Dew. I mean, not Mountain Dew, Moth Energy Drink. Fuck. Last night, awesome. somebody suggested, and I tried to swim away from the island. 
<laughs> Even after an hour swimming, there was nothing but endless oceans. Useless. Okay, so he's the killer, obviously, that's what that means if you go swimming. Just yeah, like just like Peko, Peko Yama. <laughs> well, when you guys were eating breakfast, I was checking out the supermarket again. I had to get- I had to restock, okay? Yeah, they restocked. Right. They walked into that one. Should've known they really game did. devs. Yeah, come on. These- with the super supplies, we shouldn't have to worry about starving. We had so starving much- over So many <laughs> drinks. Just- You gotta stay healthy, guys. Wait, breakfast? Oh, wait, you missed that because you were still unconscious. Oh, I thought it was morning. Is this lunch? It says daytime, I believe so I thought that meant they morning. Said, I, well, you know, lunch, did say it was noon. It was noon. You know, lunch is the most important meal of the day. I should have known. And you can see, this is a dino, but there's no one on the island to cook. Oh no. So this morning we all went to the supermarket and ate some packed lunches together. We all got some well, lunchables. Except, and well, except Hajime, he just drank like eight cans of Red Bull and caught it a day. You need <laughs> solid food, Hajime. <laughs> I know I don't! His body trans- <laughs> his body is so used to it that it takes everything and, tr and transforms it. He eats the cans. It's the <laughs> he eats the cans like a goat. He he like a the... <laughs> He's a satyr. <laughs> Dude, that, that pants guards far more than just his private parts. There's a He's whole a... mess of fur and hooves down there. He's a fucking goat man. It was very tasty, but something was lacking. You don't like Lunchables, Aroha? It had no flavor, because it was all fake. Oh, you had the crackers, bologna, and cheese one. That <laughs> sucks! The... the pizza one's where it's all at! All the Lunchables suck. True! <laughs> no! The pizza one was good! Oh, it was. It was cold pizza sauce with raw mozzarella. You never grew up poor. You don't know what it's like. I've had Lunchables before. <laughs> I know. Dude, I, had, I only had Lunchables when I was like seven. Which like the last I actually time I didn't have Lunchables that much growing up. Me neither. Even I did I. Fighting a battle I, had, like, I have no stake in. I've only had Lunchables from other kids. Now that's the best part of Lunchables. Getting food for free from kids who don't want it. Well, you like I trade I should get food. Lunchables just to see how it tastes again. Oh, no, it's not worth it. I understand the pot, you know, where everyone was went down, where everything went down last night. And I discovered something amazing! Oh, Nikkei, what did you find? That they're selling a green cheese flavor cola that was pulled off the market 10 years ago! Oh, <laughs> Holy shit. shit! They have that expired shit. <laughs> Maybe it... Apparently, it has a secret ingredient called Waze Ashes. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> no! <laughs> Seriously, right out of the vending machine. Fucking crazy, dude. Hey, come here, let me hit you. Hey, you're not giving me. This is a monster. Green cola and a monster energy. This is a monster and Red Bull ship, and you will get the fuck off right now. Not even C four. Are you joking? Dude, are bang? I love to imagine he was more. Wait, why are you friends about my discovery? That dude, that was fucking perfect. There's something. There's something. That's not about the park. Dude, Hajime <laughs> over here is playing not into even... our joke so well. He likes it too. He thinks that we're funny. Not even a bang energy. My least favorite. Yeah, so what happened yesterday? Disappeared. Disappeared. Ah, disappeared. right, right. All the stuff with the fire and burn marks disappeared. Even the corpse of that orange haired girl. That being said, you were those two people from yesterday. Anyways, I've never met them before. How about you guys? <laughs> it had to be you who asked that, just so we know. Just so we understand that you don't yeah. know things. <laughs> yeah. It still doesn't feel weird to me yet. Whatever happened to the green-haired man who got sent flying? He walks in. We just I'm here. here. Hey! Yeah. What's up, guys? And didn't we agree not to talk about last night? It's just way too complicated to understand. Oh, so you're like the forget stuff. That's right. The priority right now is talking about what everyone investigated. Yes. <clears throat> Good. Outside of those places, there's a church with a bell tower, a guest house, water houses, but none of those matter because there was absolutely nothing there! Wait, are you talking about that little. Are you taking this a little too casually? Did you even investigate properly? Oh, it's over. Don't worry, there really was nothing. 
Why is that so? All right. <laughs> What's your Shinji says there's nothing there. <laughs> the Monocruz. This boat... I went straight to the diner after I woke up, so I haven't investigated it yet. I've decided immediately as of right now, I'm going to be hanging out with the hostess girl and finishing her first. It's really like a cruise. They have a game room, a gym, a library, a shower room, etc. You knew it, they have it! Monster energy drink room. I wish. Okay, they have it, right? Or all no. just yeah, stares at me and is like, no, no? Okay, then don't say things you don't mean, Aroha. Please. For future <laughs> don't you reference. Imagine you're... Yeah, I don't you imagine you're being part of me right now. It's four fours, but the third one and fourth are reserved for our dorms. You guys may have been the voices for him, but I am him. <laughs> I am you him. You don't soul. like Monster Energy or Red Bull. I don't, but I love the passion. Okay. <laughs> our dorms? You know what? They're basically bedrooms, though. They're still locked for some reason. Yoriko told me that a whole day has passed since I was stabbed. Where did you sleep? Inside... Inside your heart. I see. Who's <sighs> ignoring him? We sat in the guest house together. Guys separated from Goris, obviously. Obviously. Except for Yuki. Except for Yuki. He's one of the Goris. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's one of the girls. <laughs> Uh, 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 of course, we're still students after all. That's a bunch of other things that are also locked, but Monocro hasn't explained why. Uh, I heard something like that. Why did Monocro? What did he say specifically? What did he say? You can't do this yet. Just wait for now. <sighs> can't use violence like that, Siobhai. Since this is an emergency, everyone should wait until I call you guys again. Warning you, CL by if this happens again, then convicts like you are gonna be executed. <laughs> you mean convicts with that? And Kokoro, did you actually like pick up on the pun and feel the need to tell me too? Yes. Is what was probably said. Probably. Probably. Why would you memorize that? Dude, you memorize all the nutritional facts of the back of a Monster Energy drink. Dude, <laughs> the open one, there's no sugar or calories! The monocruise is a lot wider than I thought. It makes me think that there's more investigating to do. I I've just realized now that when I voice the character, I close one of my eyes. <laughs> wow. I didn't do that on purpose. Did you close your right one or the left one? I close my left one. I'm a fake fan. You're a fake fan, obviously. Damn. I did it subconsciously, Damn. it doesn't count. Yeah, I know, you're mirroring it. So that's it for now? Even after everyone's done talking, we didn't learn about much. It'd be nice if an escape just went poof and showed up. Does the water food just work? Can't we just ride the ship to land? That was my Thor stop, but I couldn't find the control room. It's probably locked off. Of course, if the mastermind is smart in any way, he would just make sure we can't use the boat. Come on, Yuki, why do you gotta be so down like that? There's nothing to worry about. It's only been a day in the Mono Cruise, and it's been pretty quiet. I'm sure I'll be able to escape. This is a bit sudden, but where's Mikado? M Mikado? I saw Siobhai earlier. Wait, you met with a psychopath? You okay? Did he hurt you? <laughs> Since Mikado is the mastermind, he's our biggest clue. So we definitely looked for him at first, but... Uh, we couldn't find him. He's completely vanished. Yeah. As for Siobhai, no one wanted to get close to a psychopath like him. Except me, when I tried to give him my, his Red Bull. Luckily, he seemed to have cooled down a bit. Does everyone happen to know Siobhai's full name and talent? You know, Monaco called him Siobhai, so that's how we know. Well, he told me. His name is Siobhai Hashimoto. He's the ultimate broker. What? How did you get him to tell you, he told us we'd all have to pay some sort of fee. When I met oh. him, he apologized to me. Said he wanted to make it up to me. Another fact, she has wobbly eye lines. Ooh. Ever like so Mew slight. Does. Like Mew, except way, way more subtle. Yeah, because she's not as crazy as Mew. True. So I told him to give me his full name and talent. 
So my Hashimoto. I thought I heard that name before. I guess it really is him. You know the guy? You know each other? Yeah, I know. Me, no boy. Impossible! But he really, but he, 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 but, but he, fuck, but he is really popular on the black market. For fuck's sake. Why okay, would I Yuri? know that? Don't ask. Yuri, Yuri's <laughs> having a, having a, <laughs> having a, uh, conniption because he had to remember a boy. Aw, oh, yeah. dude. You couldn't stand <laughs> there it. There we go. He's like, a oh, boy's in my memory. Dude, the, the green in his hair is for the nausea in his soul when he has to remember a man. Train successful, 100%. Where our ability? 100%. I think he might even have a connection to the Western Mafia. Well, that's how you know him. You wouldn't think a guy like him would go and apologize like that. I was surprised too. He seemed to follow his own sort of beliefs or rules. If he's here too, he might help investigate. He's a broker. He'll definitely be good at gathering information, but we can't trust him. If we can't trust him, then working with him will actually be counterproductive. Coco, you seem very emotional on the matter. It's just, I talked to him a bit last night, and he seemed to have a bunch of cyclocks on his heart. That... I don't like it. I'm not sure what a cycloc means, but maybe it's like, like... he's beyond help. Maybe he's like is... he's fucking purposefully being hard to read and just like fucking with her. Oh, Dude, maybe. Maybe she's That's... actually psychic. That aside, how are we even supposed to trust a guy who goes around stabbing people, especially in a killing game where, huh? Uh. Instant stillness. Although we had forgotten in our happy mood, we're in a killing game right now. Oh right. Okay. Sorry, guys. I said something really uncalled for just now. No, don't worry about it. No one is going to do that here. You are doing it first. <laughs> yes. No. He's gonna, when he wants out of energy, he's gonna, he's, he's, gonna, he's, gonna, he's, gonna, he's gonna realize that someone took his energy drink. Dude, I'm gonna be so upset when he goes. Cause like, I don't see Hajime making it through this game. Like a hundred percent. You say that he has to live. Dude, his glasses will take the bullet for him, just like the mask. Habiki's probably my favorite in terms of, like, actual character in the prologue, but this is the funniest character. Exclusively from the <laughs> joke that we made. Piggybacking off a 10 <laughs> second thing he did. Yeah, if we exclude that... Mikado and Siobai. I'd be fine. You'll be fine. Monaco isn't anything, and Monaco, um, Mikado is nowhere to be found. Okay, so all we have to do is have Mikado kill Siobai. And then everything is great forever. Yeah! <laughs> Wait. Someone manipulate him into killing the other guy. Yeah, I got burned to a crisp. I guess it's... You know. That would be funny. Someone just gets burned to death, and it's just like, well, who has fire powers? <laughs> Looks over to him slowly. Mikado! And that was actually Shinji, because he's the firefighter. We might even be able to return home without incident if we just keep investigating. You don't have a home. Right as Yuki made that hope-filled observation. Damn. Hello. Damn, Hi. Oh, <clears throat> sorry, I forgot that was me. Ooh, it's I wanted to whoop you. <clears throat> Hopeful fan fanatics. Even though something like that could never happen. Sorry, my comments. Dealing with last night at Morrissey has made me quite busy. Since the preparations are finally complete, I must now re-explain. Everyone, please come to Otisimo Park. I don't feel like it. If you're absent, you'll be breaking a rule, and as such, you will be punished accordingly. And Hajime, if you don't come, I'm gonna take your energy drinks. No! That is the punishment that is according to the crime. <laughs> I knew it. Things were far too quiet. <clears throat> <clears throat> what, what, what should we do? Can't do anything except go. We'll be punished if we don't. Who's afraid of some punishment? We're not <clears throat> listening to that thing, guys, right? I don't know. I feel the same way, but I feel like we should go. <clears throat> yes, after all, Mikado really did kill someone yesterday. He saw fire out of his arms. I expect we can't be used. Uh, total hostage situation. Hey, he killed someone on the island. The killing game started. He's the blackened. <laughs> Wait a minute. We should go. Standing here won't do us any good. 
Oh, they but yeah, well, the fact that Pokemon can walk a wall, this just in. Basketball right, right, breaks his own wall. Suddenly <laughs> broken by Monocro's announcement. Y'all may know it was Roshi and Park. He didn't break a rule because the killing game didn't start yet because 17 was the extra member. Yeah. So He's gonna take getting used to this seeing like the mono crow sprite. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. <laughs> you all heal. Thank you. Wait, Seal Bind and Mikado are here too? <laughs> I not come. Where are you listening? If you don't come, you die. Mm -hmm. Greetings, everyone. It's been a while. Dude, the face is always static, but the mask yeah, changes. Yeah, but the mask so changes. Weird. I love that. I love that. He's one of my favorite designs. Just, where were you yesterday? I was talking with Monocro, planning the next few days. Oi, oi, oi! Before this guy starts giving us his explanations, let's just beat him up! We can force him to send us home! You're right! We can't ask why he kidnapped us for later! We can ask why he kidnapped us Wait, wait, everyone stop! This is not something Monaco the Crow amongst the Crows can forgive! Not the Crow amongst Crows. I called you here so that the incident, like the one Shobai caused, won't happen again. Shobai's incident? This day, the short tempered Shobai went ahead and shanked somebody before I could explain. <laughs> not shanked! There are rules to this game. It's not the fucking Hunger Games. Get this through your skulls. Violence is forbidden here. Unless you're killing someone. The only time you can harm someone is if you're murdering somebody. <laughs> he was trying to. But it wasn't time yet. It wasn't... The grace period was still on. Also, so it... Harm without the intent... Oh, harm without the intent of murder will result in punishment. That was a rule in the last game. But also, what about the time that Akane slapped Sarugi? When Sarugi had everyone punch him? Well, I don't think that... I think it means like, you know, like... Excessive violence. Yeah. Like breaking a leg or something, I would assume. So in short, if violence without the intent of murders against the rules... Yes, that is what I just said. That's right. I will also explain another rule. Very important rule. That's right, so I stab someone as soon as you hear that killing somebody allows you to... Escape the island. Fucking stop. Fucking too hasty there, so boy. Oh, doing something like that is not okay. This trip has a special rule. I know you said Siobai, but I heard Siobai, and so I will call him that from now on. Yo boy. Oh my god. Siobai. Hey, Siobai. Hey, hey. That's like his nickname. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> special rules. It's not random killing. Only those who can kill in secret and clear the crash trial can escape. Man, it'd be really great if we had Chibuya and Wei here. Crash trials. We got Yuki though, he's got experience. <laughs> if someone among you is killed after giving a certain amount of time to investigate, everyone will have to participate in a class trial. That's my favorite voice line of his. Yodi in yodi. the class trial, the Blackened must face off against the remaining spotless students in a battle. And I mean a little physical battle like fisticuffs. <laughs> With yes. everyone's left on the line. I love that it's the bird in the background this time. Yeah. I think it'd be funny if it was just Monokuma for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> Your job in trial is to debate until you expose the murderous placket. Though the final vote, the portion with the most votes, will be seen as the placket. And the sacrifice will also die. Wait, no longer. No, no, no. That no. is correct. <laughs> the sacrifice no Joe. Only the, only the blackened kill will receive punishment. The remaining students will return to their trip. Trip of the cocaine. But if the answer is wrong, then everyone become besides the blackened is punished, and then the blackened will be set free. The rules of the quest trial. Do you all understand? I'm looking at you, show boy. So, show boy. Are we just gonna call him show boy now? I mean, if you want <laughs> to, get... I'm going to. <laughs> show boy's right, his okay, actual I'm... name. Show boy's his nickname. You can call him however you want. So, Yobai's actions last night were no good at all. If Sora died, everyone would have known that Yobai was the killer. It's gonna fuck me up. Your reaction a little funny, considering that you're the mastermind. Oh, I have one more thing to give you, all of you. Is it the monocrow story? 
distributing smartphone like objects to everyone. What is this? The thing I gave you just now is the Student Handbook Plus. Yes! It's, it's, an, upgraded, it's an upgraded version of the well, only one one that used it. Who would think Academy? It's tiny. It could fit in your pocket. Mm. Yeah. I mean, that's what the first one was, right? It could fit in, like, your blazer pocket, not your pants pocket. It only works with your unique fingerprint, and contains student profiles, rules, a cleaning, uh, a chatting service. We had IM and, on this thing? And other assorted functions. Can you use a VPN? No. Everyday life without this help is nearly impossible. Do not lose it. Can't you save your game Weird. without it? Weird, there's only one... IP address and we're all on it at the same time. Isn't that weird? Uh -oh. there's, no other, there's, no, there's no other IP address available. In the entire oh. world. Interesting. The remaining rules are on that hand. If you if any of you lose it, you'll be punished for it. Well that's new. Sex worthy. So the whole Mondo taking someone else's mono pad thing's not gonna happen, I guess, if it's ID locked through fingerprints and if you lose it, you die. You keep saying punishment, but what does that mean exactly? Are we talking about sexual punishment or? <laughs> what do you mean, what? It's an execution. Death. Damn. I was really hoping for the sexual one. <laughs> Death? Wait, what did you just say? I don't say? want Nothing. a sexual punishment. Look at that face on Yuki. He does not want it. You're telling us if we want to leave, we have to kill someone? That is. <laughs> so like, okay. Yeah. Yuki, get with the program. You said that yesterday. You had a whole day to process it. Well, I should be off now. Be sure to read the remaining words in your handbook before you head back out. <laughs> Ta-ta! Unless you don't want to read it. In which case, you'll probably get executed for violating the wall. You didn't even know about <laughs> Ooh, well, at least I got some screen. Alright, thanks, bye. <laughs> <In time. laughs> before we could even reply, a monocro is gone. We're Yoda left in a state of denial. I read it. Uh, he left. We still have a amount of questions to ask him. We still had. No, no worries. Monochrome might be gone, but we do have this guy. Not he's talking like about himself. He's gonna, like, he's gonna like fly away or something. Mikado Sanoji. Huh? What about me? What do you mean, what about me? You said you're gonna miss one. You even said you talked and organized this with the Monochrome. This guy's definitely on the same wavelength as Monocro. Better if we just off him here and clear the class trial. What are you talking about? You can't kill! It doesn't seem like Mikido's going to answer him. Damn, so did, you, did you literally Guys, just someone just sacrifice him. themselves and kill him right here in front of us. Well, he like says, like, that first one's like, oh, don't kill him in front of us, because it's boring. But, like, we can just murder him here now. As long as you have the intent to murder him. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, but I guess the intent to murder me wasn't there. Maybe yeah, they meant well, the intent was to murder Yuki. Maybe that's what it meant. The intent was murder y Yuki, exactly. And then, like when you jump, he's like, "Oh shit, what did I just do? Fuck!" And then, then the intent was gone. Mm -hmm. I did say I was the mastermind, but when did I tell you I was the same page as Monocro? What do you think? Yeah, yeah. Just as I said, while I am the mastermind of this game. I will not be on the mastermind's side for the killing game. You're not on your own side? Like everyone else, I am a participant. Do you understand what I'm saying? I understand that I want you to shut your mouth. Your conditions are the same as ours. It's right, Kokoro. As she said, I can kill any one of you at any time, and any of you can kill me. And in case I also don't participate in the class trial, and I receive punishment if I lose. The same thing goes for the rules. I have no information on either. I'm truly on the listening side. What? You're fucking crazy. Wait, I was listening, and I was leaving just now, and I don't understand. If you're gonna do that from the start, why come out as the mastermind? Uh, because they said so. He had no choice, really. What do you gain from participating in this crazy game with us? Fun. Well, that's directly connected to the reason I became your kidnapper, so I can't tell you. All, all I know is that a participating student, as a participating student, I share your conditions and must participate in the killing game. 
and you expect us to believe that. Free to believe it or not believe me, I... But I speak the truth. In fact, I would like to become friends with you, acquaintances with you all. See? No, you're wrong, Dan. Acquaintances. Yeah. There's a big difference. In a situation like this, full of despair, our bonds are important, are they not? That's ridiculous! Why do you have a bond with the one who created the despair in the first place? Yeah, I could totally kill you for that! Ah, oh, yes! And I could totally kill you for that! Wait? <laughs> How much more do I need to repeat myself? I'm in this situation... I'm in the same situation as you, all of you. I mean, looking at it from this angle, Kokichi is the only example you can really have of this, and his was kind of a lie. But point is, if you're into the killing game and you like being part of it, you would never kill anyone. Kill anyone. Because no. you want to get to the end. Yeah. You don't get to see it if you win. Right away. If you kill someone and win, you don't get to see the whole thing. If you die, you don't get to see the whole thing. You would sit there and just stir up shit. So, you know, we all know Kokichi's motivations were different, but this is, uh, the same boat. Honestly, I don't know, I don't know what I would do, because I know you guys are like, let's kill Malik, uh, Malik Mercado, but I'd be too scared to talk to the guy. I mean... They're like, let's kill him, I'm not saying let's kill him, I mean, it would make sense to kill logically, him. Logically, take someone, take some, like, take him for the team, and kill him, right here, right now. Yeah. Oh, anybody want to do that? <laughs> no one raised their hands. Fucking crazy. Yeah, I mean, who would because want they to, to they, die? They die. Yeah. No one wants to die. That is death, after all. Um, but, you know, does anyone here selfless enough to do that? Firefighter, it's your job to protect people. You gotta sacrifice yourself all the time. No, so you I do. Bet, I bet, uh... <laughs> uh... <laughs> I mean, out of anyone here, he's in, like, the most of a position to do it. Yeah. He's in the most responsibility position. Like, his job is to, like, sacrifice himself to help others. I am prepared to both kill and be killed. I'd be so surprised if this guy kills. It just wouldn't make sense. Like, unless it's, like, a chapter three, everything's boring, no one's doing anything, I guess I better stir up shit kind of scenario. Wait for him to be, like, the first to <laughs> I mean, maybe. I'm no different from the other students, so treat me all the same. If you want to kill me, then <laughs> go for it. If you can, that is. Oh. What? He disappeared. Use That's Dimension's the... door. Damn, is this the same magic we saw last night? Everyone, I understand your hatred towards Mikado, but if we kill him, we become killers. I know, but I can't help getting so pissed off. To be fair, it's not easy to kill someone, even if you hate them, but no, no, man. Yeah. If you have a gun, it's pretty easy. No one here is gonna kill anyways. Setsuka. Don't think about the weird guys like Siobai and Mikado. Just pretend it's all of us. Setsuka's right. <laughs> Let those guys do as they please. Um, I'm against this. <laughs> Shouldn't we boot up those student handbooks we received? That's right. It sounded like the rules are really important anyway, so... <laughs> Trying to calm down ourselves as we did. Uh, we did as Yoruko said and check the rules. Do we can be in English? Oh my god. Do you, guys, uh, do you guys check like all the profiles of the characters? We do usually do that. We, we didn't. Will... We okay, didn't I was just that. curious. Because most we people don't do that when they play these games, so I was we, just curious. We tried to do it in the first game, but it was all in Korea. Yeah. Uh, well, I don't think it is in this one. I would I assume not because the store is been in Korean Korea. yet. Like, nothing at all has yeah. been in Korean. All the stuff that's, like, the kanji, that's all Japanese. Like, this would usually be fucking kanji, too. Mm -hmm. The Pope's Peak Kai School. I'm not sure if it's called kanji in Korean, but... Well, I don't know. Whatever it is. The, the script. Uh, upon pressing the power button and scanning our finger by touching the screen, start it up, showing our name. But I'm sure Sora is just a made-up name, so why is it appearing on here, too? No time limit. Saving discussion for later, we decided to look at the rules. Mm -hmm. Okay, so far so good. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, here, straight up shown. In case of multiple blackened killers in quick succession, only the first killer is recognized. That bothered me for so much in the first two games. And then his answer, Monokuma was just like, well, it's not going to happen, so grow up. And then they actually answered it in the, in the third game. Uh, like, well, uh, scary monsters. Oh, okay. Dio? Patrol Utsuro Shia and harm any that come at oh, Dio's no. part 7 it's stand. Mitch. Scary monsters. What? Mitch. Dude, it's Mitch. <laughs> He's going to attack us at night. Any harm that comes from these beasts is your responsibility. What the fuck? Minecraft? We got monsters at night? I was gonna say, I'd be pretty, pretty well, interesting if there's some unique rules here, but nah. What happens if they kill you? Uh, too bad. I guess there's no trial then. During nighttime, you're only allowed to sleep in your own room in the monocruise. Sleeping in another room or outside your room is against the rules. Yeah, I mean. Violence is forbidden on Utsuroshima. This includes violence against Monocro and the destruction of property. However, violence with the intent of murder is excluded. Monocro is not involved in any killing. Student Handbook Plus, limited to one person, operated by fingerprint. It's completely carelessly lost. You will be punished. After three students discover a body, body discovery announcement will play. Whether this includes the culprit sighting is on a case by case basis. That's good to know. Case by case basis. Freely allowed to investigate Utsuroshima. No specific restrictions. Rules can be added and removed as needed. This is a lot of rules. Yep. First thoughts reading the rules are mostly filled with confusion. Some rules are self-explanatory, others we didn't fully understand. Scary monsters. Yeah, what the fuck? Why are there so many? Wait, what's with rule number eight monsters? Monster energy drink? Is that what they mean? <laughs> I thought I was leaving. Rule seven and nine tell us we can't leave the monocles at night, so maybe it doesn't matter. What's rule 13 by discovery announcement? I'm not sure, but it seems like three people need to discover a body for the announcement to play. Ugh, none of these help us in the slightest. Yes? But, well, the rules don't restrict us from investigating, so we just gotta keep it up. Yes. That's right. No matter how perfect the mastermind might think he is, he must have made a mistake. Somewhere that might let us escape. Dude, if I were Kajime, I would feed Nagito with my mouth, honestly. Yeah. Like what? a bird. You're telling me you wouldn't do that to Nagito Komaeda? Yeah, because either you no, do it and you do it because you like him, or you do it because you hate him. It's funny either way. Because it's like, okay, okay, let me spit in your food and spit it in your <laughs> mouth because I fucking hate you because you, this is probably gross. Or let me do this because you're my lover and I love you. <laughs> You'd be like, oh my god, the hope you have to do that. Ugh. So much hope. Don't pay attention to them. Those two are bound to the rules. They can't do anything to us. Ah! All right. Now we've read the rules. Let's get back to investigating. Sure, it might be confusing, but we have to do something. Hi, hi. <laughs> hi, hi. You can't avoid him. Join him. Let's go, Kanade. Hi. Um, don't just wait up, sis. Something. All right. It's got an info on Wolf of Kuz, too. Get, get out of here. I love that pose. <laughs> well, the atmosphere is literally not... like his splash art. Yeah. Yeah. Got much more tense since Monocro arrived. I'm glad we were able to stay somewhat positive. Even if we don't know a lot, as long as we trust each other, life on the island will be okay. This is how our despair filled school trip began on the island of nowhere. 